When walking on this coral, be very careful. This stuff will slice through most shoes. And if a piece of coral looks fishy, <laughs> it probably is. That is a stonefish. The most venomous fish in the world. Now these guys can stay out of the water for 24 hours. When the tide goes out, they stay in these little pools. The tide comes back in, they sit and feed. Meanwhile, you try not to tread on this. This looks just like this, which looks just like that. Which looks like any other rock around here. Perfect, perfect camouflage. Now these little dark spots right here, I don't know if you can see them. They look like eyes, they're not actually, that's camouflage. That just makes them look very scary. The eyes are in fact right here. And there, right up front. If you look here, just right on the top here, that's why it's called a stonefish. It looks just like a piece of coral, but right here is the number one spine. Look at that. Now along the ridge, right along the backbone here, there are 13 of these, and each one of these spines has two venom glands at the bottom. And what happens, you walk along merrily through the coral with your nice rubber shoes on, and you step on this guy. These spines will immediately stand up. You'll step on them, and when you push the skin down, that compresses the venom gland and venom shoots up into your skin. That will make you scream like you've never screamed before. You'll go back into the water, go find a box jellyfish just to take the edge off. If you step on these guys, guaranteed hospitalization, and actually, it is the second most administered antivenin on the continent. Although this guy can stay out of water for 24 hours, it's actually a stinking hot day. And uh, I can actually put him in a pond or pool over there and get him out of here. Come here, don't bite the hand that feeds you. Good God, don't ever do this, okay? I'm a trained professional. <laughs> God, that doesn't feel right. Good God, you're ugly. But I suppose to Mrs. Stonefish, he's quite a catch.